Ready? recording. It's actually recording. Oh, actually, I'm right now we're at the uh, festival. And um, I said I'm going to do some videos today about uh, different people with different circumstances, how they pretty much, for the most part, overcame their uh, illness. And this is Dawn. Dawn. Dawn came up to me. Hi, my name is Arnold. No, you said, I said that. <laughs> <laughs> I am so confused. Anyway, Dawn said she had uh, Clays and Crohn's. And Clays and Crohn's is really tough to get rid of. So she said to me, um, I got rid of it. For most part. Why don't you explain your story? Um, Crohn's took the better part of my life. and um, What does that mean, took the better part of your life? It put me in bed. 24-7, um, constantly sick, steroids, all kinds of drugs. Um, very, very ill. Wheelchair. I Wheelchair. Have, I have fibromyalgia as yeah, well. Yeah, fibromyalgia, you have Crohn's, and you're in bed 24-7. Yes. You weren't a happy camper. No, I wasn't. And I was diagnosed in 94. Five, lost two years of my life, tried to go back to work for three years, made it about a year and a half, and um, I haven't worked since until last summer. I started a part-time job, and I can't do a whole lot of that, but I'm still rebuilding my body, so I changed so that, my diet. What does that mean, you change your diet? I went from eating everything they told me to eat to eating Who's the medical? Yes. The medical, they had it, they have said... I what saw a nutritionist. You saw a nutritionist. They gave you, what did they yeah. tell you to eat? They told me to eat brown rice. Brown rice. And potatoes. Potatoes. And um, stay away from nuts and seeds. And I started eating nut butter and learned how to like yogurt in the beginning. And uh, just started putting nutrition in my body. Right. And my body went downhill. I just, it went downhill. Oh my gosh, yes. Right. I dropped I dropped weight. That was not the purpose. It was just to try to have a quality of life. Right. And I have truly healed myself from the inside out. I've been raw now about 90% for over a year. Um, What's your raw look like? Out of curiosity. What does my raw look like? Like I know my raw, but I know is your raw like my raw? My raw is nut butters, um, almonds. Um, Gee, uh, sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, fruit. I had spinach soup yesterday right, right. For, for lunch. Um, you know, if I emulsify everything, it breaks down So you put everything in a blender? Um, for the most part, the, the vegetables, I, I do right now. I'm hoping to... So your vegetables and, and, and nut butter? Mm -hmm. And I eat yogurt. I do I eat yogurt, yogurt okay. because I want to keep, keep right. that up. But raisins, all kinds of dehydrated fruits, pineapple. Um, and you completely recovered. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, my That's doctor shook her head. She said she couldn't believe that right. I can eat like I do. And how long did it take you? I started in 2006. I got the official word that I'm in remission in wow. July of wow. this year. Wow. So two years ago, I had improved. So I guess we're on almost some of my fourth year. Fourth year. And the fourth year. You feel like is, now you're getting stronger and stronger. I am alive. Wow. And the next part, speaking of strength, yeah. is the physical aspect right. of it. Rebounding. Yeah, I used to rebound in the 80s. And, wow. You know, I, I rebound done pretty that. much every day. Yeah. Well, for me, walking is, walk is a is, wonderful thing yeah. right now. You were, you were in a wheelchair too. Mm -hmm. wow. Yeah, I have a ramp in front of my house. The wheelchair is in the attic. Wow. Yeah. That's huge. funny. We have a woman called, uh, I can't I mention her dead. name, but she, she, she's fighting both. <laughs> I mean, she's fighting MS and uh, Clay's and Clones. My sister has MS. Yeah, it's yeah. tough. There is life. If anybody is watching this, because I wasn't planning on doing this. Oh, you weren't planning on But if, if anybody is mm. watching this, just, it, it is key. Food will change your life. Oh, good. And once you change your life with nutrition, everything else just comes to you. And you just get up in the morning, open your eyes, and say, thank you, and mm. move on with your day. Yeah, right now, at the festival right now, there's a lot of people I see in the audience. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right, say Hi. something. Hurry up. Say something. Hi. Hey, what are you going to do October 9th? Oh, we're going to do a, a class for kids' nutrition. Um, just some quick, healthy snacks for kids. They can get hands-on and get involved with it, too. It'll be fun. Any so, ideas? Give them a, what's going to uh, be in the class? Any ideas of what? What we talked about last night? Remember? No. Okay. Top secret. <laughs> Top secret. October 9th, we're going to give a class of nutrition. And who else is there? Anybody else? Joey's, uh, why talk about Megan real fast? That's Joey. Man, Megan is a busy girl right now. She's running all over the place, setting up for this festival, but it's turning out pretty good. That's so her boyfriend. <laughs> yeah. But I'm over here because Arnold blocked the exit to the parking lot, so I need to move his car. So that's what I'm doing here.
I could make it. We're gonna move the car so I can say you can get out. So I can get out. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, this is over. <laughs> Festival time.